Is this the stage you would like to go to? Welcome back to Let's Play Sonic Adventure 2 Episode 45! I'm your host, Ultra Director Jester, here with the Niskel, and guess where we're going now? Oh, uh, I knew I heard some hesitation in your voice. We're going to space! We're going to space. <laughs> Yay! And I'm, ma I'm mad we're going to space. I'm just so angry that we're <laughs> in space. So fucking mad. Can we have, like, a pissed off universe in the next game? Oh, hey! So we'll do it as Chaos Zero, so I'm not as pissed. Okay. Figgle Gnorwa. So, and so, we got a problem right off the bat. Oh, you can't break the crates! It's just the Rouge stages! I don't understand why! It's only the Rouge stages that ever give me this big of a fucking headache. <laughs> so now what? Well, we're gonna have to do this legitimately then. And by legitimately, I mean with our max score and our max lives and our uh, <laughs> turbo and super flight enabled and uh, chaos zero enabled and uh, mm -hmm. you know, yes, yes. So as legit as as legit as we've come to know the series so far. Right, right, right. But luckily, I will just skip ahead to where we actually find them. Oh, thank you, thank you. Uh, so that metal crate at the beginning, was that needed, or was it just like, hey, here's a crate, you can break it for like a power-up or something? Uh, when the fir when you start Mad Space for the first time, you don't, fuck, you don't have your, uh, your pick nails yet that break open, or whatever nails, whatever uh... heals fucking break open the steel crates, you gotta go to a different planet for that. And that's a good way to start the level quickly when you get the pick nails, and that was also a way to see if we can actually break those steel crates, which we can't, which means we're fucked! And which means you don't have the fuck it button either. <laughs> Nothing is I, working. Because that for some reason doesn't work on this level either. <laughs> you just can't win, can you? Not with Rouge, no. <laughs> She's breaking <sighs> everything. She is. <laughs> and it's so funny. I'm sorry I'm like laughing at your misfortune, but this, this is truly funny to me. Hey, hey. I understand like entirely. It's okay. It's just, it's just, of all the characters to screw up, like, Mechless Eggman did nothing. Uh, Tails, when he transformed to that, into that Chow thing, did nothing to the game. But Rouge, of all characters, is the one breaking the game. Of all characters. She's the one who's like, D did I accidentally rewrite some code when I did the extra <laughs> replay things? Or maybe the codes are wrong? I, I, I don't know, but either way, whenever Rouge is involved, things don't go well. They like, just I'm don't. Just I'm just waiting for your game to, like, blue screen or something. I know it wouldn't make sense, but in this context, <laughs> it would be perfect. You've been playing too much Eternal Darkness, haven't you? <laughs> or maybe, like, System 32 all of a sudden is deleted in this Sonic Adventure game. Something, <laughs> because it would be... it would be perfect. How could something in Windows be deleted in Sonic Adventure? Well, at this point, are, would you be s surprised? I mean... I'd be... I'd be more confused than anything. <laughs> It's like all, all of a sudden you you get the the uh, the Mac issue that happens. Like all of a sudden it changes operating systems on you. It just suddenly turns Linux. There's a uh, there's one small tactic I'm going to be using in this level. Okay. Because because the gravity is sometimes strange. Whenever I get on a rocket Whoa. or something, if I continue to do the turbo boost, I will continue to go in that direction. Oh. It's a quick way to go up fast. Okay. Fast. But finding these rings is proving to be a little bit of a hassle, as you can uh, clearly <sighs> see. Yeah, I was I was wondering about that because this place is so big, and I'm I'm assuming there's not a lot of rings that are just like out in the open. Uh, this well, is going to be really fun. Well, there are. It, it helps to know where exactly they are and where to go, but I don't. So <laughs> yeah. There's also, like, what, 15 tiers to this level? There are so many layers to it just is of this stage. Yeah. It is insanely tall, and I do I do enjoy that, I guess. I do enjoy the, the verticalness of this, this particular level, at least. I like Knuckles' stage better because there's actually a floor. <laughs> oh, right. That, I completely forgot about that. There is no floor. There is no floor here. So it's a good thing you at least have one cheat that's working. Yeah. There should be some rings around here somewhere, you know. Again, I, I, I look at a video guide before attempting these, so I, I at least have some general sense on where to go. But, see, the, the genius who's doing these A-rank levels, he moves so fast, and I forget where a lot of these boxes are. 
<laughs> oh, God. I-, I thought you were about to say not even he knew where they were. <laughs> so he's just, like, running around like an asshole like you are. Just going, where are these rings? Where? <laughs> Unfortunately, no. There should be, like, if anything, the ring boxes should be plentiful around here, especially if you're, like, flying around everywhere. Yeah, but they're also hanging out, like, in the middle of, the sp- of like, the air. So it's uh, kind of well, hard to... Yeah. Yeah. Again, you, you still gotta know where they are. Yeah, and bitter irony would denote that every single uh, crate that you can't break has, like, ten rings in them. Just expect, you know, remember back when Sonic Adventure 1 had, like, 40 ring boxes? Yeah, that was amazing. That was yeah, those, those aren't like, here anymore. Oh, those of course here they're anymore. not. Yeah. Really could have used, to, like, two of those. Just to make it harder for you. I am confident at this point <laughs> we are under time. So let's try it again. <laughs> you know, I was actually thinking, oh, it would be really funny... If, uh, you know, if Chaos Zero, the ultimate being, or the start of the ultimate being, just came burning up in our atmosphere, just coming down trying to find rings. Well, there was a 20 I missed the first time, and look how subtle that keep your rings when you restart the level yeah, is. Yeah, isn't that wonderful? Oh, yeah. wow. 91 rings. Means I just gotta find a couple of, uh, there's some ring boxes around here, but I gotta get those and we're done. Gotta do it in time, though. Gotta do it in time, though. Okay, okay, you, you go a little bit faster. I mean, you're running out of time here, dude. Yeah. Maybe this is how that guy did it. You say he was going too fast to follow. So maybe this was his tactic. Maybe he's just like, okay, so what you gotta do is you gotta put in the uh, the cheat, and you just reset your game tons of times and get the 20 box. He had the good grace to not talk during his, comments, his uh, gameplay, though. <laughs> So does that mean we could just technically take the... I'm kidding. Well, without, <laughs> well, you see, we do it because we tell jokes and we also tell context. Right, right, right. Not, not, you, know, you can't really... You know, weak justification, weak justification. <laughs> anyway, uh, third stage. Here we go. I, I, I'm just saying, like, something happens as we're talking and we kind of miss it. And you, you're like, oh, yeah, it's uh, totally meant to do that thing that just happened. Yeah. Well, now here's where things start to get a little, uh... Oh, yay. Uh, Perfect. Okay. We can't find the chow, or at least you can't get it in the, the oh, regular no. sense. We can find the chow. Finding the chow is not an issue. Not an issue at all. I know exactly where he is. It's just going to take a couple minutes to get up there. Take a I few take minutes to get it up. Here. Woo! I thought it like a rocket! Oh, and I blew him away! Uh, Whoa! Yeah. Whoa! All right, you you went through a couple pieces of something. Uh, so this this chow is up here, just like all the way up here. Yeah, he's he's fucking up, man. So all you have to do is just essentially just take all the rockets, just up and up and up, get as high as the chow is, and then yeah. you got him. The rockets are faster than cheating, but you know, hey, I can't really grab a lot of the rockets. <laughs> So here we go. Here's the Mystic Melody that we need. Oh. Yep. Fucking, yep. Oh. Still got 100 rings from last time. <laughs> <laughs> oh, cool. That counts. So quick, do all the 100 ring stages now. Get them done and over with. We're still Knuckles. You're kidding. No. We're still Knuckles. Which means that now I gotta remove some codes, do this properly, which means that we have to do this stage as Rouge. You have to be kidding! I'm Doesn't sorry. the game know when it's Knuckles and when it's Rouge? I, I don't know. Like I said, it's just this stage where it happens. Like it, like in the other stage when I'm somebody else, it's like, you know, ha ha, you know, you know, those words don't come out of that character and they go away after I reset the codes. But for some reason, the game seems to always think that Rouge is Knuckles. Is it the way they're programmed? Is it the way that these uh, hunting stages work? that Bruges is actually Knuckles and they can only afford to do one type of programming for that? I, I, I don't know. Well, that gets me to thinking that, you know, every character, you can change them into a different character because of multiplayer and all that good stuff. But this leads me to believe that they literally only programmed one type of character for Knuckles and Rouge and just threw a skin on the other one. That's the only thing I can think of. Because everybody else is unique in the fact that they don't fuck up the game <laughs> when you change them. Oh, shit. But it's always rude. Oh, fuck the... <laughs> <laughs> oh, 
both for <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's perfect. That was amazing. Oh, it said, screw you, UDJ. You're not going through that portal. I saw you as Knuckles the other day. Well, fine then. Let's have some fun. All right, what you got? Oh, are we... Li oh, cool. I thought we were literally going to burn up in the atmosphere. That would have been fun. We're at the tippy top, and I'm going to somehow Ooh. kick my way into victory. Uh, I'm not going to do good this round. Uh, come on, come on. Uh. Okay, I know we're I know we're all like laughing and have a good time, but seriously, that that enemy is bullshit. Oh god, I hate those guys. That was like the yeah. worst enemy. Locus and Roos don't have a, a lock on move either, like Sonic and Shadow do, or even Eggs and Eggs and Tail Man. Eh, that's about what I said. Eggman and, <laughs> and Tails. Eggs and Tails. <laughs> eggs and tails. <laughs> the story of Eggs and Tails. Hi, welcome to Denny's. Can I take your order? Yeah, I have an Eggs and Tailman, please. <laughs> Uh, I'm sorry, sir. We just sold out of our eggs and tails. Would you like some uh, some deep fried hedgehog? You see, also there were uh, steel crates that were blocking us to getting to the chow. So even if we weren't knuckles, we still couldn't break the t the steel crates to even get okay. the chow. So yeah, makes sense. Oh, that, that's still hilarious. It's it's only rouge. Th that's so, <laughs> that's the it's problem. Only rouge. Like the, the codes don't work as well with her. I don't know. I mean, the game's crashed twice when playing with Rouge with codes on. Well, now it's time to collect the emeralds. In four and a half minutes, let's go! <sighs> They're not in the same spots, are they? Uh, no. Alright. <laughs> but luckily, I have hints. Uh... Because I can use however many hints I want, it's not going to affect my score. <laughs> 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 So I can take as long as I want. Well, I can't take as long as I want, but I can cheat as yeah, much as I want yeah, to at least. In a manner of speaking, you can take as long as you want. That's true. That's true. Oh. Aha! There's one over here. Uh -huh. These emerald stages are so riveting. I mean, I just love them! Hey, we don't have, we don't have much more to go. Okay. I think we just got Knuckles' stage, and I believe that is it for actually hunting emeralds. Oh my god, Knuckles in space, I could just see it. Whoa! At, least getting, at least we're getting the more difficult uh, space stage out of the way. Wait, wait, why are all the other hints jumbled, but that one was just like a flat place? Because it's lying. It's actually a bumpy place, a not flat place. So these hints are liars? Yes. Do you not remember the gimmick of this stage? What, that everything lies and tries to trick you? The detector readings are reversed. So... It's mm. like, yes, yes, Omo Chow is annoying, but he tells you this in the first thing from the star. Oh, burning up in the atmosphere. Love it. Starting anyway. all over again. Love it even more. Oh, well, well your time's pretty good, though. Uh. <laughs> that reset. Oh, that reset your emeralds, too. I missed that. Alrighty, uh, so everything uh, has been jumbled up again. Emeralds are in different locations. Awesome. Just <laughs> fucking love emerald stages. There's my frustration <laughs> move. <laughs> that's the, uh, that's like fuck it button 2.0. It's just like, I don't even want to deal with this. Get me out of here. That was a literal fuck it button. <laughs> I, don't, I no longer wish to live on this planet. <laughs> So this is all a space station, right? For yeah, I, I guess I want to think it's like a little bit outside of Ark. Uh, okay, because I was thinking this was pulling like a, a Mario Galaxy. Like this is a separate galaxy as opposed to you know Earth downstairs. Me oh there oh we go. oh ha uh, uh hey you got him! What a weird place to hide an emerald. You know, just in the side of a planetoid. Yeah, oh, look at that. Perfect. Yeah. Th that bat and that knucklehead will never think to look in the planetoids. These asteroids are perfect hiding spots. Is this the stage you'd well. like to go to? All right, Hard now, mode. Now it's time to get interesting. Yes. Let's see. Where, oh where, could they be hiding these motherfucking emeralds? Hmm. Alright, that's bullshit. 
If anything, that guy's easier. Well, I mean, yeah, he doesn't have the little grabby arms, but now he's just, like, constantly firing at you. As I recall, first one's around in here, I think. Hmm. I'm just waiting for the spike balls to, like, the asteroids become the spike balls. And then, you know, every ground texture is a spike ball. Just everything with spike balls, just to make this infinitely harder. Well, the thing about this hard mode is that this is a huge stage. And because of so- Oh, wait! Aha! Oh, wait, wait. I, I, I got a reading, Captain! Excellent. Go towards uh, the emerald. Oh, we know it's there. Oh, ho, ho. Underneath here. All right, there it is. Wow. Let's just get the... Whoa, ch can't, all right, got it. Oh, forget that. You'd, have, you'd probably have to go up above and swoop from underneath to get it. <laughs> yeah, I'm sure. All right, wow. next one. Hmm. You know, I still like the idea that uh, all the springs become spike balls, you know, because screw the player. This is hard mode, not 1999 mode. <laughs> Artificial difficulty. You know, at, at this point with Rouge, I'm expecting like a chain chomp to be up here in space. Art artificial difficulty in a <laughs> Sonic game? No! <laughs> uh -oh. Blasphemy, I say. I mean, if the ranks weren't already that, then uh, I don't know what is. If I didn't have to get all A ranks, we wouldn't have to be doing this. So, what do you think has like the stricter ranks? Th these games, these older games, or the new modern Sonic ones? They're both bullshit, if you ask me. Oh, well, okay. But I'm meaning, like, these are doable, in a sense, with cheats, but I think, like, like modern Sonic, especially Sonic Unleashed, was just awful at giving out ranks. It was just so difficult to please the game. I don't think so. I think... Seriously, I think that the newer Sonic games are easier to S-rank than uh, the older Sonic games. And by that, I mean Sonic 06 and behind. <laughs> because the control is much more... Well, I wouldn't say perfect, but the control is a lot easier to, to maneuver in, in those games. Yeah, I can see it. And I was actually thinking for, of the... For example, you can press the bumpers to... I mean, they go left and right when you're running down a straight path. That is nice. What a, what a fucking kill for that in this game. Yeah, the strafing, very, very welcome in the newer Sonic games. And I was actually thinking of Sonic Generations when I was talking about that, because some of those missions, really hard to get an S rank, but if you keep at it enough, you do it. It found that sweet spot where they're not impossible, but they do ha offer a little bit of challenge to get them. So. These are fucking impossible. Oh, yeah, th fuck these. <laughs> I would not want to be in your shoes, especially for, what, 20, 20 episodes now? And we've been just going for A ranks for everybody? We have to get all 180 here, so... But I gotta say, the kids are loving it. Out of control... The, the platform in the out of control area? What? Well, that, I mean, that's... at the rate you're playing, this entire playthrough is out of control. Whoa! 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 <laughs> you find those emeralds, Rouge! Bitch, <laughs> I just dive bomb to your death. Fuck it. Woo! It's actually in a pretty... Yeah, the biggest meteorite. It's actually the smallest meteorite. Oh, uh, the trickster. <laughs> Is this the trickster Means comet? That's... I don't know. Oh, they're good. Oh, wait. The smallest comet? Where? It's close. Is it? I'm not lying. It's close. Okay. It's, it's not the only floating platform right below the round meteorite. <laughs> Which means it is. Oh, well, yeah, there it is. What? Uh, yeah, I, I got a hit, I think. I, I need to get get back over there. Where, where, where'd it go? No, it's, it's, I was just there. Where'd it go? No, you're uh, supposed to take that hit. Where is it? Oh, there, there it is. Where? There we go. Oh, my God, really? How do we get it? Let's see. Where? Really? What? Like, Really? <laughs> Oh, gravity! Gotta How? love it. There's a platform I... directly underneath that has uh... the emerald. And it's because of gravity. God, this loss sucks. 
Break and the law, th Rouge. Break the law. Whoa. <laughs> Do, 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 How's that for breaking do, the law? Well, actually, that'd be do, kind of accurate do, do, do. because there's no atmosphere in space. I mean, do you know, I'm just not even going to try and bring physics into this shit. Hey, wait a minute. Like, what What? What the hell? How is Rouge breathing? I do not understand. Please explain, science man. Repeat to yourself, it's just a let's play. You should really just relax. Not only that, it's just a video game. <laughs> Can we please get somebody to do a, a deep theoretical analysis on how Rouge is able to breathe in space? Is it because of, like, special sonic bat lungs or something like that? Her tits are oxygen tanks. How's that? <gasps> Bro, they, like, inflate and deflate whenever she needs to take a breath. There, got it. There we go. Holy shit. So to get where's... a good running start. All right, so where's the third one? Ain't that a good question. You go up to a hint box and it says, check disc two. Ah! <laughs> you piece of shit! This really is hard mode! Oh, that'd be the worst. <laughs> I mean, changing discs is one thing, but changing discs, you know, mid-stage, that's unforgivable. <laughs> it doesn't even give you a prompt. It's just like, okay, do, do, do I do it, like, like, right now? Or when it actually tells me to? And if you do it just one step wrong just ruins everything. Oh, Jesus. I don't even know what I'm doing. I'm not even getting a hit anywhere. Something, maybe I gotta hit a switch. If I hit a switch, maybe something... What the f- Oh, hard mode. Hard <laughs> mode! That went All through right. the box! It's clipping through the crates. That's wonderful. That's, wow. that's special. It's that's, that's very, very special. Well, let's skip ahead to where I actually get a clue, because I spent at least about 15 minutes trying to figure out where the fuck this fucking thing is. Good lord! Before I had to look it up and remember and go, oh yeah, that's right. Alright, so. I've now looked up where exactly it is. I now have a clue. Let's get this back on track. Very good, very good. Take the rocket, off goes the rouge! And up we go. So she's hitting the stratosphere. What do we do? We're going to go as high up as we feel like. Pray to God. There we go. <laughs> oh, good. Yeah, let's just see uh, the clipping through space. That's good. The fog bringing in the meteorites. That's also good. <laughs> These programmers suck. I mean, I could do better. <laughs> ah, Aww. Shit. God! No. No. <laughs> uh, yes! See why I'm mad in space? I'm angry. I'm upset. I'm frustrated. I am frazzled. I am angered. I am... I'm going to start, Man. like, wrecking things. Just, like, flipping tables. You know, destroying galaxies. Just throw everything into a blender and just watch it burn and destroy itself. I gotta get all 180 emblems first, and then we'll see what happens after that. Please, please, God, don't destroy your Adventure uh, 2 disc. There. Oh, Alright. Now what? All the way over here in the corner where no one would ever think to look. Really? What, right here? There's your spike balls and your oh, meteorite. Finally. You gotta do you gotta do a perfect uppercut, pretty much, <sighs> in order to grab it just right. God! Ugh. Jeez. That was really stupid. <laughs> That's about that? the best I can put it. Like I mean, God! Ugh. That was really bad. It was. But I got a few upsides here. Okay. Well done. <gasps> oh! Finally! Not easy, tell you well what. Done. Holy crap, dude! Well she done. took it kicking and biting and screaming, but we finally finished all of Rouge's stages. Jeez! And that's one more emblem for us. 
Is this the stage? <sighs> Fun's not over yet. Let's head yes. to the Chow World. Oh, good. So, all right. I've taken out a few codes. I put some back oh, in. So, uh, let's go to Shadow and have some fun with good old Shithy. What, you don't want to be rude and have your chows hate you and crash the game? No, nah, I want them to love me, especially for what we're going to be doing. Oh, okay. <gasps> oh, and, and we're Metal Sonic. Oh, again. that's cool. That actually looks really cool. Problem with Metal Sonic is that he has a problem with breaking. <laughs> <laughs> oh, As in, wow. he, when he gets to go and he doesn't stop, really. <laughs> Whoa. He's got a problem. Yeah, he, he he doesn't really stop. He just kind of keeps gliding right there, you know. Yeah. It's, like, it's like a brick on the on the accelerometer, or the acceleration. You just can't stop it. Well, Metal Sonic doesn't know anything about slowing down. All he knows is fast, fast, fast. Go fast. So let's go ahead and pick up. Well, okay, Deji May from Tear, but we're not going to be doing anything with Deji May. Oh. We're just take it back and we'll head to Shithy. I have added a brand new code. Hmm. Besides the Metal Sonic one. Okay. That, I put that in when we put Amy in. But I added oh. a brand new code to help us buff up our chows. Ah, all right. What you got? Okay, so four chaos drives, and uh, yeah, that's nice. Okay, well, leave, leave them here. We're going to head down and see Shithy. Oh, okay. So you're just dropping one kid off to pick up the one you love better. Yeah. Okay. Well, the one who's more affiliated with him. We don't want to have, uh, we don't want Shithy to have any mixed messages that good people can be bad, too, and bad people can be good. <laughs> exactly, little shithead. Hey! Uh, there's so, our monstrosity. Well, we got a problem breaking, so it's going to be hard to really pick him up, but, you know, we'll just pick him up here. Okay. Got him. Don't you hate it when that happens, when you're trying to, like, hug your kid, but you just can't stop? Oh, I think I forgot something. Okay, here we go. Oh, hey, look at that. It's four chaos drives again. Huh. Has he always been that level? Those levels? Uh, yes. God, I have not... This is, ac I this have is accurate. not been paying attention. We've, we've been taking care of him for a while now. Episode 45, we've, we've done a lot with him. Yeah, exactly. We've been taking care of this shithead for all these episodes. Let's go back in again. Oh, no way! Is that one of every drive every time you one go of, in? One of every drive whenever I press the Z button, but I have to leave and come back for it to actually replenish. Oh, okay. So all I gotta do is I just gotta keep getting these chaos drives and... See, I've, I've already done it with Dejime. Dejime is like level, almost level 30 on all of his stats except for stamina. Holy crap! So I just gotta press Z and then... Oh, there they ah! are. <laughs> That's pretty cool. So what kind of fun can we have with that? Well, I mean, you can have the most buff chow. I suppose. I suppose. I could just, you know, keep replenishing him and keep bringing him back. Like I said, that's what I've done with uh, Dejime already. But what hmm. other kind of fun can we have? I wonder... What if I keep pressing the button that gives me chows whenever what? he tries to give me some? Oh, that's cool! The problem is, though, whenever that happens, a lot of these chow drives become null, and they don't work. Oh, and it's also slowing the game down. Exactly! <laughs> GameCube can't handle it! Ah! So let's do this for a couple minutes and see just how far <laughs> the game will chug. Oh, no! The name can't even process this. Like, all of shit, these stats are trying to implode with the rest of the world. There is a massive delay, and being Metal Sonic, I can't really exactly slow down, so I'm going to have to throw Dejime here at some point, because I can't really break. I can't. I can't. Oh, this is fantastic. <laughs> Woo! Oh. It's like I need to get rid of him. Oh. Sorry about that. Oh, God. I feel so bad. <laughs> Look at that slowdown. Oh, my God. The one time I didn't want to abuse my chow, it has to be this time. <laughs> Look at all these chaos drives. A lot of them are unusable. Rolling around at the speed of sound. Drop go. <laughs> gotta follow my rainbow. 
Oh, this is fantastic. Metal Sonic, the fastest thing alive and the best thing to, to completely murder your GameCube. <laughs> How far can it go? Is it going to crash the game? Oh, wait. It's just going to... It's despawning stop spawning. them. It's, it's stopped spawning them now because I... It just stopped. Aw, so. oh, damn it. Oh, wow, it's a lot. Oh, holy crud. <laughs> and I'm thinking each one of those is its own individual <laughs> sprite. So, yeah, you you pretty much hit peak to where the game's uh, trying to... It's trying to crash, but it can't. I should do this again with debug mode. <laughs> Let's just see us spawn a million. <laughs> How many poly can we many? <laughs> All the polys. Oh, wow. I would laugh if it continued in this room. <laughs> like, the entire world is just dying because of you. There we go. All fixed. Oh, uh, well, everything despawned. Cool. So, all right, that was fun. We'll see you next time. Let's play Sonic Adventure 2. All right. Woo! Wow. That was fun. <laughs>